Hello everyone, welcome to Programming Knowledge. So I again welcome you all to yet another tutorial at Programming Knowledge. So in today's tutorial, we are going to cover about graph theory. So let's uh, go with our next topic. But before that, we can you can uh, uh, go to our repository and download all the code available in Python prior to, prior to this tutorial. So let's get started with today's tutorial. So today's tutorial, we are going to learn about topological sort. So topological sort via a source removal algorithm. So basically source removal algorithm is a technique to implement topological sort. So before uh, we proceed to topological sort, we need to remember few points. That is the graph should be DAC that is uh, directed and acyclic. So basically it should be directed, directed and acyclic. So basically uh, the graph should be first directed a graph and it should be acyclic and what does topological sort means for every edge u to v u will come before v in the ordering of the graph okay so and then we have a term called in degree that is incoming edges on the node and there is also a term called out degree that is outgoing edges of the node but we don't deal with it during the topological sort so hence we uh, uh, need to remember three points first it should be directed and acyclic then for every edge u to v, u will come before v in the ordering of the graph and this ordering is known as topological ordering or topological sort and n degrees incoming edges on the node. Okay, so let's move to further. Now we have a graph. Now we implement the source removal algorithm. First, we need to look the node with minimum n degree. So you can identify the node with the minimum n degree is that is the node b. So we take node B. So let's write node B here and remove node B and all the edges associated with it. So here we remove B and all the edges associated with it. Now we have a node with minimum degree is A. So let's write here A here. Either you can uh, read first or write first. It doesn't matter. Now we remove A and all the nodes associated with A. Now, uh, now we remove the node with minimum degree. So basically, in the, uh, uh, now what we can calculate the n degree. Suppose this has uh, this has two n degree. This has one n degree. Sorry, one, and this has zero n degree. So we remove d. Like this is the way we remove. Okay. Now let's remove d. And all the edges associated with D. Now we remove D. Like this process goes on. B A D. Now we have C and E. So here you can see the node with the minimum in degree is C. Then we remove C and all the edges associated with C. Now we remove E in the end. So before we remove E, let's me write c here sorry c and then when i remove e in the end then e will come and so i also remove e so this is the main topological sort of our graph so here it follows uh, uh, like the for if there was a h2 uh, b to a then b will come before the a in the ordering so it follows this rule u will come before v in the ordering of the graph if there exists the edge u to v so this is the topological sort so basically topological sort uh, is, is a linear ordering and we try to solve this use in a linear linear time so basically what we are going to implement breadth first search which is linear in time and the time complexity will be o big o of v plus e so time complexity is equal to big o v plus e so we, we are going to use bfs so uh, let's uh, let me show you the test cases of this graph yeah so this is the test case of the, our graph this is uh, the similar one uh, which uh, i had uh, uh, this is the graph which i had shown you so uh, that is a to c a to d b to a b to d so here you can see a to c a to d b to a b to d then c to e so we have c to e and d to c and d to e so it satisfies all the conditions 
now let's implement this algorithm so this is a, already I have made the template how to take input from the graph so it would save uh, us time and we could concentrate on the uh, logic part so let's uh, continue with the code so we will implement like first we need to uh, make a note of the degree so degree we have to make the node of the degree and here you can see that uh, for I will also pass V here okay uh, there's a small issue in this code I need to change the variable name vertices vertex comma e and we, I will send g comma vertex and here I will take g comma vertex now I will implement a array which will take a note of all the degree so degree is equal to 0 star vertex now for node in g if there is a node in g for adjacency node in in g of node so here you can uh, uh, here you can visualize the adjacency list then i need to increment the degree then degree because this is an outgoing edge but an incoming edge for the agency node like here you can imagine that that from there will be a going edge from node to agency node so degree of since this is an outgoing edge from our node but an incoming edge for agency node then we increment the inc uh, uh, degree of agency node by plus one okay so this is what we do so degree of agency node plus equal to one so we increment the degree of agency node so by this we keep a track of all the degree of the nodes now we need to start with the node we will do, do bfs so we'll take a queue here so this is uh, we can uh, start with the node which has 0 in degree so what we can do we can do i or i in range 1 if degree of i is equal to 0 so this would uh, implement a queue which has 0 uh, nodes with zero degree so this would be the initial node uh, like uh, for, our, for our case in the graph it was B now what we can do so for node for every node in BFS I we can say then for agency node of G of node we move to agency node and now we decrease the we now we decrease the uh, degree of the agency node because we are removing the edges uh, remember the case when we also used to erase the edges then if we erase the edges then the degree of agency node becomes zero okay now if degree of agency node is equal equal to 0 then we iteratively call this for or we iteratively call this for topological sort then in the end we return this bfs q okay now degree is equal to 0 star vertex but uh, i'll explain you again uh, this would uh, give you a quick overview uh, like for every degree first we uh, make an array which keeps a track of degree uh, then for node in graph then for agency node in graph of node we do degree of agency node plus equal to 1 so this is the one part then uh, we initialize a queue uh, which has a degree 0 then for node in BFS for agency node in graph of node degree of agency node we decrease the uh, degree if we remove the edge 
but uh, uh, while removing the edges if we come across a node which has zero uh, degree then we iteratively call this for uh, topological sort then we return this queue now let's run this algorithm now let's run this algorithm now okay for i in range e now let's run this algorithm yeah okay i have an issue with this graph Uh, so I have rectified the error uh, basically the error was like uh, I had already made the template but I had to uh, 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 this was not for alphabetics uh, that that was for integers but now I have converted this to from I uh, to for the uh, alphabetic code since uh, I made the values using the ASCII values then I converted back to them so basically now here you can see uh, I can run this code I'll copy these test cases I'll move to the code now make, uh, run this code now here you can see when I put the test cases I get the order which was expected basically an error which I had was that the first I made the code for the integer values but since in the input I had characters so I converted them to the uh, using the ASCII value then I reverted them by uh, them again using the ASCII value so it was a change so here you can see the code and you can implement the code and thank you guys thank you for watching my video so i'll catch you in the next tutorial